It's got the tanks in the back. Now this lever here, actually this one drops down the blade. So as you can see here, got the blade with a, like it looks like a canvas towel. Now that one, what it does is it takes the oxygen out of the water so the ice dries better. There's a seat. I don't see no seat belt. Let me see here how fast it goes. There's a RPM gauge, gas gauge, amps I think. It's electric. I don't see no miles per hour gauge. There's a pedal. As you can see here, this one's lifted up, so the snow goes in there. And underneath is where the blade is. It's hard to see, it's kind of dark, as you can see, it looks like the blade's right there. That one turns around at full speed, it's very dangerous, very, very sharp. And um, I don't know how many gallons of snow one of these holds. And we can see this one's pretty old. And you see that hole up there, that's where the snow goes through and it dumps in inside there. Then when they're gonna dump it out, it goes on a, um, looks like a, there's a hydraulic right there. Those are the hydraulics, that one, to push it up. I think they're working on this one we got another one intact, made by Frank Zamboni, the inventor of this. I think back in the 50s? Not, not sure. These are pretty old Zams, but I'm still sure they still work. One story I heard in the Midwest that an employee took his Zam out, was drunk, drove it around town, actually went through a drive through with the Zam. That's a pretty interesting story. Somewhere in the Midwest, I don't know exactly where. Here's another Zam. This one looks a little bit more modern and uh, and the uh, gauges. It looks a little bit more modern in the gauges here. It's got a horn. Got all the switches there, keys. Got some of these levers. I have no idea how to operate one of these. I've never tried. It's the only thing I've probably never done in hockey or in the rink. I've done everything else, gold judge, all that, timekeeper, referee, ice maintenance, but never actually driven one of these. They do have a pattern of how it goes. And you can see this one is equipped with a brush. This will sweep the sides. Tires have the metal studs on it. What do you call them? I got the name. <laughs> so here's a close up of the. Let's see if we can take a good view. No, it's too dark, but there's the. There's the blades right in there. This one's actually the one that kind of curls the snow up. Metal step. See the bottom of this. That's pretty soft stuff, soft material. And uh, they do fill these up with water. So I, this is the water tank right here. So you get these ready. So just before they go on, it has to be filled up with water. And I think they can adjust how much water they want to use. It's a full view of it. Don't know what these retail for, have no idea. But uh, there is one company that will make some Zamboni. They're in Paramount, California. That's where it originated. And I think they still make them there. All made in the USA. Don't know how heavy this is. And still don't know how fast it goes. But um, I'm guessing probably 25 miles an hour at the most. That's my guess, no idea. Don't know how fast the uh, blades turn. 
These are the two. And we'll see you guys next time.